all eyes on me. Let me see him, see him, see him. You know what my name is. What's my name? What's my name? Uma, say it louder. What's my name? What's my name? Uma. Tell me she's not giving Uma descendants. Tell me. Roll the clip. Peeps up and down the city, don't try to come for me. Welcome back for another video. So you guys, how's it going? How's fall? How's the weather on your end? All right, so we're back for another fall list video. Um, so um, it's pretty clear what we're doing here today, right? We need to try coffee. We need to try to find a good combination. I picked a coffee and a creamer. We're gonna give it a whirl. We're gonna see, does the combination work? Oh, sorry, pause, subscribe, like, blah, blah, blah. If I act as though I've already had some coffee, mind your business. Anyways, moving right along. We're familiar with the Starbucks. Sometimes the specialty flavors, you know, you gotta get it in person. Sometimes the at-home specialty flavors, they just Other times, they end up being better. Most people don't realize pumpkin, pumpkin spice, not always the same thing, but that's a different conversation for a different video, if you know what I mean. Let's be wild and go for a cinnamon toast crunch cereal coffee creamer. And yeah, I like to keep it spicy. <laughs> Pumpkin spicy. Don't unsubscribe. Let's just give her a little whiff, okay? Shall we? Let's just. Okay, already aroma is giving. She is giving. So imagine the cereal smell, but then also imagine unicorns. Excited about her. Just so we're clear, this is only gonna be a test of the combination with the coffee and the creamer. We're not gonna add any cigar. We're not gonna add any other creamers, any syrups, any other anything else. Just one, two, combination. ASMR for your troubles. Already off the bat, I can say, damn. Okay, the aroma of the coffee is definitely very reminiscent of if you actually went up to the coffee shop. So that's a plus. If nothing else, your house is going to smell wonderful. So let's see if the taste combination is actually going to hit. SpongeBob cup. Not required, but it, it helps. It helps. You guys, I think I've created something. This might be the new Judy drink combination. This shit here really brought out the, the flavors in a way that you would not, that you would not expect. You don't have to worry about adding a whole bunch of different stuff to your coffee. Now, if you wanted to add something else, you could. The only thing missing that I think that will really top this off, y'all already know what I'm gonna say, is a little shh, a little whipped cream on the top. Mm, it's still a little hot, it's still a little hot, it's still a little hot. I'm gonna try this iced. That's gonna be the real test, cause you know the gals, you know we love our iced coffee. You know what I'm saying? Oh, why don't you come up and see me sometime? Oh. This might be enough coffee for you today. I'm losing it. Tell me I don't really like all my honey. Tell me I'm not giving you the fantasy. So anyway, that's all that we have for you today. Don't forget to subscribe and click the thumbs up because I know that you loved it. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!